An Airbus jet with nearly 100 people on board went down in a residential neighborhood in the city of Karachi. brother the one who loved me unconditionally he would message me he would call me just to tell me that you need to go out and get some vitamin d he was the most wonderful being on the planet earth because he loved unconditionally and after his the miss we've heard people have been coming up and sharing how he's been helpful towards people how lahore became a second home for them because he used to counsel them regarding any aspect of life because he was so learned he was so knowledgeable he was always concerned about making lives of others better so that the other person could be a little 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 bit happier you know we used to be like uh, best friends people used to think that we're twins last conversation we were reviving our childhood memories and uh, then we started talking about come come to karachi get your tickets because kia yeah, was on flights were operative and the next day he was when to come that was very on short notice very much on short notice i wasn't expecting all were devastated we didn't know what to do we were hoping that there are going to be some sort of survivors and maybe wahi can be one of them they were running from one hospital to the other to the other there were no representatives there was no help desk and family they would go every day to the hospitals looking for my brother's body without any help desk without any information without any guidance so when i started seeing our vlogs i contacted him and uh, he sent his sample to lahore uh, laboratory and he got his results within the span of 6 hours and he was so confident so confident that i didn't give it a second thought and i went for it this was all done by volunteers we made a team collectively and we started collecting uh, swab tests and we started sending them to lahore and we started getting our results very very quickly very fast and it turned out that the body that was ours was about to be handed over to somebody else and we were asked to rush to the place and tag our body when we got on the train uh, i told them that uh, there must be new sops for the aerostress they said they are and i said to hey take a couple of pictures and uh, send them to me so before the take off from the hot he did send me a couple of pictures i didn't realize that was the last after his death some people said such amazing things about him by i must say he exceeded uh, my expectations and i'm uh, very proud to uh, father of a shaheed the accident shouldn't have happened there have been flaws on every end be it pilot be it the uh, airbus be it the systems of pia here be it how they should have responded how they should have dealt with the families without being empathetic to loan the misery after the accident we went through what we saw is 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 unexplainable it's it's very painful for many people not only for us for many families KU has has played a very bad role more they could have been productive they could have helped us while we were sending our dna samples to lahore we approached mr um, dr ishtia when the families went there for their dna samples he he refused to help us he turned off his mobile and we had to do those tests ourselves what we want is a proper system there should be some some authority to help us to tell us what's going on what's next there's no information nothing pia yeah, you should stand up government should stand up prime minister should stand up civil aviation should, should stand up we should stand as one nation we should stand we are not divided punjab sind frontier balochistan no we are one nation and as one humanity we should stand for humanity we we should be in this together we should be in every disaster in any accident where are people succeeding where where people are standing together united strong 
This goal is not only for PK8303 victims. This goal is for our country, for humanity, for everybody, for our citizens. I love you, I love you a lot. And I know you're in the most beautiful place. I'm going to see you soon.